literally, where the fuck are we? I don't think this is smart. But there's no road. We're going, we don't need roads. <laughs> don't touch the blade. It is poisoned. What? They're going after this dude's life right now. We gotta go stop him real quick. They're Whoa. testing you out right now. You know, what's gonna trigger you? Hey, there's so many. Oh no, there's actually like weird little markings up here too. Only those symbols are written in blood. So they were saying like in that room is where they did the sacrifices. What the? Did you guys just like a? Uh... That's a paw print. What's up? Oh. I'll find a skin walker, but I ain't finding Mother Earth. <laughs> 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 So what I ask in spiritual language is that anything evil has oh. been here and they continue to stay here. Welcome to TFIL and our subscriber challenge series where for 30 videos, your comments, your ideas, your challenges, <laughs> decide what we have to do. And one of the number one comments we saw was go look for skinwalkers. And we found some Native American medicine men uh -huh. that are taking us where, Corey? We have no idea where we're going. <laughs> we are in the back of a truck driving into the middle of the desert with no service. And we don't yeah. even know what's about to happen. They're leading us right now. Marty, our Estonian uh, camera guy friend who does not have a license in this country, Stop. is currently driving us <laughs> as we follow oh a truck. God. Followed by their security, because <laughs> yep. they said they require security tonight yeah. for where we're going. Because yeah, we're not so supposed crazy. to be going where we're going. <laughs> and if this goes well tonight, they said they're going to take us three hours deeper into the center of the reservation. They wholeheartedly believe that skinwalkers originated from. Thank you guys for commenting this. <laughs> they also that they've encountered UFOs exactly where they're taking us they tomorrow. Shut yes. Up. Tomorrow we don't die tonight. Skinwalker hunters on three. Oh my god. Yeah, yeah. One, two, two three. three. Skinwalker skin hunters. hunters. I love that you said Woo. that because you're not supposed to say skinwalker out loud. <gasps> the party just went, oh, Corey. <laughs> <laughs> it's okay. If you say it backwards, it cancels it out. <laughs> on three. Two, two three. three. I said skinwalker. Nice, 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 nice. Skinwalker, Skinwalker, Skinwalker. Stop! <laughs> Ever since you said about it running, I'm scared now. Really? Wait, but well, you're not supposed to be scared. Why? Because that's because like, they'll come what? at you, right? Yeah. Oh, okay. I'm ready. What? Are you gonna say he's a Skinwalker? Skinwalker? Oh wait, don't say it. We have said it. Hey, hey! I'm not no Skinwalker. I'm about to fall off. Bro. <laughs> We're out here, out here now, dude. Oh We're literally just following them into absolutely where oh, We met them at a gas all. station <laughs> 10 minutes ago. Literally. And went, yeah. all right, we'll follow you. <laughs> they're recommended by Patty. Yep. Yeah. Yep. And they've done a lot of paracon events. Trust I trust them. Yes. Yep. We trust them. And they're like seven feet tall, so that's helpful. That's true. That Wait, how tall are skinwalkers? <laughs> <laughs> are we being like... Stop, 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 stop. Oh, stop, 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 stop. No. Well, I feel like that hamster meme where it's like <laughs> Where are we though, dude? Dude, we where the f are we? Dude, we are out here. Literally, where the f are we? Yeah. What's up? How's it going? Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you too. How you How's it going, man? guys? Nice to meet you. How's it going? Good to meet you guys. Man. How you doing, yeah, sir? Doing pretty good. Yeah. Good. Bring it in, dog. Sean Glenn, hey. hero. Bring it in, yes. Dog. Glad you guys made it out here Sweet. and survived dirt road. This is crazy. Yeah. Yeah. So we're gonna don up some uh, some of our sacred gear, some of our sacred armor. With it being in the middle of nowhere, you can get a little sketchy out here. Okay. So we're your security. We're your bodyguards. Your guides. And sometimes when you go into the spiritual world, especially when you're hanging out with indigenous people, you gotta be prepared. Yeah. When so, you got into that dirt road, that's when you got onto the Navajo Nation. So now you uh, guys are officially on the res now. So, oh, wow. Yeah. Wow. So, uh, we got, so we're going to go ahead and get ready for this you is all. pretty awesome. So we're going to make sure you guys are all safe and have a good time tonight. We're going to get you guys oh, ready too. So I was kind of scared, but then when I saw you do your little bunny hop, I'm like, ah, right, we're good. We're going to be all right. We're going to be all right. Wait, do you have a samurai sword? Yeah. What? 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 One of our sacred weapons. Oh, oh what? Oh, no. Just don't touch the blade. Really? Yeah, it is poisoned. What? With what? Like poison to human or poison to the human? I have the herb in here for the antidote just in case. Wait, what's on the blade? Don't touch it. I know. Just don't touch the, the, the end of the blade. <laughs> Dog. But those, that's don't a... even open it. 
<laughs> You're about to lick it? In English, it's um, uh, Black Raven. So it's already earned a name. Black Raven? What is it? Do Wait, what? So, uh, have you had to use this for human before? Skinwalkers. <laughs> Which are pretty much half human, half spirits. Wait, have you, like, struck a skinwalker with that? Take a look at deeper into the blade. Oh, gosh. What the f***? You want one that's even more battle torn than this one? What? Dog. What? Dude, are we. Are we. <gasps> Stop! That's one of our retired blades. What? Oh, and it's dripping. Is that the. That's the poison? Oh, 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 touch it, touch it! <laughs> that's the one that's, that's oh, the one. I was like, you just said that to touch the table. He said that to touch the table. <laughs> Corey, I'm just going to tell you right now, I'm not doing another ghost hunt unless I have a samurai sword. <laughs> I will dedicate you to it. I don't care. I'm Everywhere I go from now on, I'm ghost hunting like this. So, uh, this ash is a blessed ash. The reason for the ash is for protection. Uh, you guys are going to want to go ahead and like dip your fingers in here. And you're gonna wanna go ahead and put it on the bottom of your feet where you can pour it out. For the males, you do the left side first, and the females, you do right side. So, left, you go left, right, and then you do your heart, your back, and then your palms left, right, and then you do your forehead. And I will say, personally, if you guys have any relatives or pull out your phones that are on the wallpaper, I recommend you change that to something that's not a family member or something like that. Hey, feeling Corey? That's not like Good. I just, oh dude, I was trying to find a picture so fast to change my wallpaper. Oh really? Yeah. You have something on your forehead if you want me to get it off. No, 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 no. <laughs> <laughs> Would you guys like me to go into the origin story of the Skinwalkers? Yeah. Here? Yes, so, the borders of the Navajo Nation are based off of four sacred mountains. There's two in Colorado, one in Arizona, and one in New Mexico. These medicinal people, a long time ago, the spirits taught them how to shapeshift to be able to go to these four sacred mountains in a matter of hours. So in that ceremony, they had to gather herbs and learn how to to gather those objects for the protection ceremony that they were going to do. Along the way, darkness kind of came in. To be able to learn how to shapeshift is a long and tedious process that takes years to do it in a good way. Evil came about that I could teach you how to do it in a quick and fast way. But there's certain things that you have to do, certain sacrifices you have to make. You have to sacrifice your most loved one. The one you hold dearest to your heart, you have to sacrifice. As well as, that's just the first step. There's so many other darker steps that I kind of honestly won't go into, but it's very, very gruesome to be able to go into that. They're grave robbers. Dig them up, get their bones and grind it up. Mix it with poison, pull that poison in your face. Four days, if you don't get a ceremony, then you will die. So they have bone knives, bone darts, everything that they use in their arsenal. Reason why we have these armors, things here, swords and all that to protect ourselves. What'd you give us? <laughs> so, yeah. so I'm also going to be giving each of you guys another level of protection here. So each of you is going to have an arrowhead. These are your eyes to keep. <gasps> oh, thank you. Seven forbid anything happened to us and you guys are running for your lives. That's going to be able to at least stand its ground and protect you guys. Are we going to a cave tonight? Oh yeah. <laughs> I love when someone speaks like the Kool-Aid man. Oh yeah. <laughs> this excites us. This is living life, man. Outside of what yeah, until we die. <laughs> <laughs> so those kids, this is a picture in the book behind. What no? Oh. <laughs> is that what they look like? Partially, yeah. Like, yeah that's yeah. cool. What? The kid's just smiling too. He's just like, yeah. So they processed the photos and they didn't realize it until later on. They did, these kids didn't even know that these things are. Sorry guys, if they start grabbing at you from the side of the truck. Is that possible? <laughs> there, there's a lot of stories where the skinwalkers are able to keep up with vehicles. Shut up! I was really joking about that! Just theater! The <laughs> yeah, dude. That's, that's just like looking at you while you're going! <laughs> 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 Snatches us off the back. <laughs> I'm kind of scared, Loki. I'm trying to keep my composure. Uh, dude. Never done shit like this before. I'm scared. <laughs> so cool. So what's like the like worst like, thing that could happen? Literally, what I'm scared the most is like us getting snatched off one by one. Like ah. imagine, like I turn around, Ginger's just gone. Well then, you don't have to be scared. Ginger has to be scared. <laughs> <laughs> so, oh, like, yes. 
<laughs> That's literally what I thought I was gonna do. Your hands, your hands. <laughs> I got you. <laughs> oh, Elton. Elton. You can't tell oh, me your biggest fear. I feel like if we hit a, a, a big enough pothole, that's just gonna go straight in your face. Oh my god, dude. Don't <laughs> say that, bro. Shit. That would have, it's gonna be an arrowhead. <laughs> Taken out by our own arrow through the night. This is fun. I like adventure. Yes. This is crazy. This is a good idea. Oh, yeah. The cave? <laughs> what the f? Huh? What? What were you singing? We've already begun to mentally with the skinwalkers. Who knows? They might be on channel 13 as well. Oh, hey, Mr. Skinwalker. How you, how you doing, honey? How you doing? Hmm, what kind of little bird are you going to be tonight? Are you going to be an owl? Are you going to be a hawk? Huh? Are you going to be a little coyote? Are you going to be a deer? Are you going to be an elk? What are you feeling like tonight, honey? Hmm? <laughs> what if we just see a person standing? That would be amazing. Well, that's, what? that's, like, are there that's why we're here. Uh-huh. Yeah, that'd be so great. Oh, we're going off-road type of shit. Get ready, it's gonna be fun. Okay. Oh, no. oh shit. <laughs> oh shit. Oh, oh shit. <laughs> Except for that. Ten, ten seconds ago, I thought somebody was standing at the top of that thing over there. What? Or like the top of that hill. Where are we driving to? <laughs> Where are oh. we? That we lost? No, this is a bigger dip. Maybe it's a sign. Let's go. Get real creative with your driving skills. I hope one of you has the skills of Dominic Toretto in here. I'm more of a Letty myself. It's Fast and Furious. Oh. Yes, I, yes. I have no idea. I thought it was a F1. No, Dominic Toretto? <laughs> I don't know. You've never seen any Fast and Furious movie at Vin Diesel? I have a vagina. No, I haven't seen it. <laughs> <laughs> Why would any girl watch Fast and Furious? What do you mean? It's just such a guy movie. Yeah. Kim's watched them all with me three times. When's the last time oh. you had sex with Kim? <laughs> Skinwalkers, I just want to let you know that if you guys would like to help plant some trees, all you have to do is subscribe to the channel that you're about to be on when we capture you. And every new subscriber equals one tree planted. So just go ahead and hit that button right now, Mr. Skinwalker, and we'll plant some trees out here, give you some more coverage before we find you. Over. So we have found a path manageable, so we're gonna go ahead and move, make our way forward. I don't think this is smart, but well, look, there's no road. <laughs> <laughs> Roads? We're going, we don't need roads. <laughs> <laughs> what? Okay, okay. <laughs> hey, that was <laughs> sick. <laughs> that was sick. <laughs> you want me to drive? Maybe it makes more sense. Sure, I'll <laughs> and dude, I'll rip this thing around. Bro. <laughs> Wait a minute. Can we be inside? <laughs> Just don't want to be the one who beat the hey, car clips. Oh. <laughs> Y'all good? Yeah. 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 Is the car good? Is the car okay? Yeah. yeah. My tires. What? <laughs> this feels like a Jurassic Park ride. Dude, for real. <laughs> oh, thanks. Hey. Is it disrespectful to pee pee here? One thing, if you do pee here, cover it with sand. Like kick some sand over it because oh. they can witch you with that too. Never f mind. <laughs> <laughs> I ain't pissing nowhere. I'll pee. Right now, I want you guys to look around. Look how dark it is right now. Is when you go out on these missions or you go out to see these, find the skinwalkers or go against them, you have to know your terrain, you have to know your surrounding. Right now, we're in a choke point. This is a great spot for an ambush. So, as a warrior, you gotta look in front of you, you gotta look behind you, also look above you. Be careful because you might be able to see a silhouette of somebody standing up there. And as you guys have seen, there's no cars out here. So you probably know what it is. What's your scouting report say? Clear to an extent. Clear to an extent. Alright everybody, so we're gonna go ahead and move away. What the f Dog, he has his knife thingy. <laughs> Dude, yes! 
<laughs> Did you get scared that evil? I should have known this. Dude, you know, I had this thing like literally in between my knuckles. And then I just, I put it. Oh my. Remind, let me remind you an hour, about an hour ago, you said if a skinwalker comes up, I'm gonna just. <laughs> Dude. So this is like the second time it's happened, but I just keep trying to like, you know, look up like you're saying. For real. And it keeps looking like I'm seeing like a stick and then it immediately disappears. So that's one thing is they play with the mind. Like I say, they're playing with your fears right now. They're testing you out right now to see, you know, what's gonna trigger you. Oh, interesting. Man, I'm really scared of donuts. Oh my oh, God. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, that's oh, a bad show. Oh my oh, God. God. Hell yeah. Did anyone just realize that we have like the perfect horror movie stereotype group? <laughs> we have like the stoner dude who dies like second we have the funny one we have the chick and then we have like the asshole like we have like the perfect stereotype of like oh, every horror movie ever wait so who dies first you said he dies second yeah norm normally it's the asshole then the stoner then the girl and then the dude makes it out or sometimes the girl oh, makes it out sick okay so we yeah, could just survive really yeah let's investigate person. guys go ahead and stay here real quick i'm gonna make sure Every time he pulls up the floor, dude, I just think of LARPing. <laughs> and like, I want to be so serious, but also I just think of LARPing. That's so cool. Clear. Clear. Who's next? We get to go up there? Yeah. How are you getting Whoa. down? Whoa, what? You didn't hear that behind you? Huh? I'll go. Yeah, maybe yeah. it's my mind. What the f are we doing? Was that cave inhabited at one point, or does it just happen to be a cave? Yeah, that's a skinwalker cave up there, the old one. You can see the fires that used to burn, and then this is where they would do the sacrifices, where they do the satanic rituals, is that cave right there. When you get in there, you'll see it opens up a little bit, and you're able to see kind of little areas where they did their stuff. What? Oh god, how the frick did you get up here? Just run, just run. Oh, there goes all my stuff. <laughs> just think of yourself like a goat. I'm a goat, I'm a goat. <laughs> Ah. I'm a goat! Okay. I'm a goat! Yes! Yes! <laughs> Sounds like a low budget Pokemon. <laughs> I'm a goat, I'm a goat, I'm a goat, I'm a goat. <laughs> <laughs> Try to catch him. I need a strong, hefty man up here. I got the hefty part for you. <laughs> you guys, this is really cool up here. Really? Yeah. Say less. I'm a goat. I'm a goat. I kind of want to go down there. Yeah, try not to fall because these go pretty far. So, I'll be first. What the f We're gonna do that. Where do you go? What do you? Careful right here, Corey. There's a hole. What the f? What the f? I think I hear a woman down there. No, no, shh. Guys. Hold it, guys. Shh, shh. Tell everyone. Tell everyone. Shh. Ooh. Is anyone down there? I don't know what that was. Guys, go ahead and keep going. Keep on coming in. Try to find a spot to chill. All right, we're good. You look comfortable, Corey. I actually am. This is actually really chill. So if you guys take notice, the black markings that are right here, this is where they had like a fire inside of here. where they would do the sacrifices and all those other dark things and this is where those kids were too. What kids? The ones in the picture. Oh shh. Oh, looks so like this uh, is where we're taking pictures. Looks like fingers or like chalk marks. Right behind you. Oh, See where I'm shining the light? Those three right there? Yeah. Oh right here. That's insane. So I guess we can all I don't know if we can all fit What's in here or maybe just take turns. Get closer. 
So if you guys notice, when it's completely quiet, you hear a buzzing noise, it's not silence. You hear that buzzing that's like, wee. Mm -hmm. that's, that's high energy. So what? it means that there's a, the energy is elevated in this area. It's very clear. It's like, So when you hear silence, you know, it's like you don't hear anything, mm -hmm. but you hear the ringing. Right now it's that buzzing. Is my brother out there? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. That was weird. No, I still hear it. Yeah. So do I. It's buzzing still. It's so weird. That's like tinnitus. Hush doing the inlet. Hi, Bush's chin. So what I'm doing is I'm speaking the Navajo language. See if any Navajo spirits might be in here since we're on the Navajo Nation. I go pretty deep down, huh? You said that one goes into like another room down there. That that room we came from? It goes it connects in there. Yeah. Oh really? So I could crawl through? Possibly. I wouldn't recommend it though. All that loose sand, this is all sand, compacted. Could collapse too. Stop. Alright nah, dude, chill. <laughs> <laughs> I'll find a skinwalker, but I ain't finding Mother Earth. <laughs> yeah. Dude. So just wouldn't recommend bumping in the walls too much. Oh, it's not like we're in the state that has like one of the largest canyons in the world or something. <laughs> like how I said before, this is the cave where those pictures were taken. So you can see those kids might have been chilling here, and that head popped out of that corner right there. Maybe he's hiding in there. Are you joking? No. That was right there? Not specifically right there, but it could be. So let's see, there's these openings like this to where they could have been hiding when they walked in. This is the networks of the old... Can I go in there? Uh, I don't, no one's been in there, dog. I recommend... You do? I do? You, you want to take this? Careful. Oh, that's sick. He's going to go in there huh? without a knife or anything. Yeah, you want me to go in there with this? Don't cut yourself. That's insane. Does it open up even more? It goes like to 10 different other ways. Holy shit, dude, there's a massive room back there. Oh, look, there's footprints. What? Someone's been here, look. Right? Yeah, that's 100% a footprint. A boot print, boot print, boot print, boot print. And they said <clears throat> all this charring is from fires. Oh, all of this. So they were saying like in that room is where they did, they did the sacrifices. For the brain. What well, makes me wonder if they've never been further. How many more did that collapse then? Oh, that is actually pretty It goes and goes and goes, Evan. Yeah? Yeah. Let me see the other camera. Yeah. So it goes up there, down there, and then it goes way down there. There's a carving in that rock right there. Look. Oh yeah, you're right. What is that? It looks like a bird. See that? Where is that anything? Yeah, yeah, these these could be like the checkpoint marks to say, hey, this is our claim by so and so. So it's like oh, I always said, like tagging. Kind of. Yeah. There, there's like different factions and different clans, I guess you can say, of skinwalkers, different families and kind of rogue, rogues, I guess you could say. So a skinwalker probably did that. Probably. So I can't say it's not 100%, but that more than looks like it. Reason why I'm making question it, because normally those symbols are written in blood. Uh, but, like oh, I said- Oh, you're familiar with those symbols? Yeah, it looks like one of them. I can't read it. My brother knows how to read these, but like I said, this soft sand, there could have been blood that just after all these years, just wiped away. Let me, um, I'm gonna, I'm gonna make my way in there. Something got like burned, burned back here. There's like a whole ash pile. Whoa. It's not like rock, it's actual like something got burned. Whoa, that's scary, bro. Uh, I see it. This is more than ash, looks like items burned in it. There was like one boot print right here. 
Mm -hmm. And that's it. And there's no more footprints up here at all. Look like one person like poked their head up here and then stopped. Which is weird because... Oh no, there's actually like weird little markings up here too. Let me, um, let me see if I can There's like a weird little like cross and a couple lines. Like someone actually like drew something right here. Oh, we found some carvings out there too. These are like in soft sand though. You want to take a picture of it? Uh, I'll record a... I mean, they don't really show up, hold because yeah, maybe my brother can decipher this. I have my phone, I can pass it. There it is, I see it now. Okay, I'll trade you spots real quick. Cool. Alright, guys, come on. What the <laughs> <laughs> Your old belt just came undone. Dude. This isn't supposed to come off like that. Trying to disarm you. See, this is one of those belts. Look. They're like, oh, oh wow. wow. Oh, wow. Then this just popped off just now. Okay, let's. Wow. All right. Yeah. That is pretty wild. That was crazy how loud that was. That was insane. Yeah, it was right next to us. It what sounded like, was that? Huge me and Evan were went, standing like this, and like right, it sounded like it was like a foot or two behind us. It was just like, like a buzzing or static sound. How can someone move? Oh, sorry. I did not like that noise. What'd you hear? What'd you hear? I heard like a... Was it like the static? No. It sounded like a rock shifting or like a giant hand like sliding across one of these stones. Yeah, at first I thought like my bag hit something but I was like, I'm nowhere near it. I like did that. Yeah, so I like came from like right there. Oh, 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 oh. Oh, 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 oh. You good, you good, you good. <laughs> you good. I'm gonna save me. <laughs> you good, man. That was a hell of a slide. Golly. You go up here with uh, Elton and Corey. Right. Translate. I'm gonna take these guys to the room. Damn, this is this is literally a setup for this disaster. Fun? Oh. Oh, a setup for disaster. <laughs> We're getting separated from a group. We don't know if you've seen the video or not, but this thing broke. Okay. Two and a half years ago. We never thought it would go off. It's literally in next to impossible to get to go off. You have to physically touch it. Okay. There's no other like possible way. So like you normally have to be like right there. Gotcha. So what I'm gonna go ahead and do is kind of like how we start with like uh, kind of paranormal investigating and stuff when we do talk with the spirits. I'll speak in uh, the what I call in English called the spiritual language, and then um, if need be, we'll go to a song, and that usually opens things up pretty good. So, Colton, if you can just uh, hold still. Yeah. <clears throat> Ja konti altaat sin zegenis, bigti to nasti jeje. Oko na a, bigti to sin ti din tioga. Kosin si alta, osko si senti, bigti di alta hosiga. A onche jeshti do onka, iki di senti osin na sali, bigto na haga. This right here was a doorway right here too. This had a roof right here. This used to be like a little table right here. Oh wow. So there was another room that went that way too. So throughout time, all this collapsed underneath. So this used to be the, the old city right here where they used to hang out and hide. They ran rampant with evil and darkness. So that's all they knew, witches and evil. And they used to do a lot of those things to where it plagued them. Watch up there, this one. Well, Yeah, just watch that this far. So, um... What do you think it is? Something not good, definitely. Colton, real quick. Hold my sword. So I don't know if my brother explained to you, sometimes when holding weapons, they don't come. Because mm. they'll feel threatened. Or intimidated. Get that so! Oh, they're gone, ha!
Ti te che, cho che on ho na ha. Do tsun tsu yon nakti, do ti di yon no, was ti di yon ha ya tsuka. Anniche, teoto. So what I asked in the spiritual language, is there ever, ever anything evil that's been here and it continues to stay here? That's when it went off right that's after? That's when it went off. Oh. I'm, I'm telling you, look, it like... it went three, right? Or two? It went bleh, 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 and then a little small one. Yeah. Uh, I'm Genuinely, when I say, like, out of everything we've ever used, that and the our EVP recorder, like, the two that, when they go off. We know. That, I'm, I'm telling you, you have to like touch, you have to get within two inches to make that go off. Is there anything you want me to ask in the spiritual language? <sighs> mm. Do I technically have a weapon on me? With the arrowhead? Yeah. Yeah, same. So are we eliminating? You guys kind of having it is okay for you guys. Like an arrowhead I think is all right to okay. be just protecting your yourselves. Now, Big ass blades, a different story. <laughs> right, yeah. Maybe could you try to ask, like, you try to ask how many years they've been here for? Mm -hmm. So since we've established that this thing is is born of not goodness, not not, not of of evil, and it acknowledge it itself, I'm gonna go ahead and sing a song that may or may not piss it off. But because it's a good song, he may get pissed off, or it may get pissed off. You know, it's interesting if that happens. We never actually like explained how the box works or how to interact with it. And the only time it went off is when you asked if it was something evil. And like we never explained how to communicate through it, which means it just like transmitted yeah. energy at will to make that happen. You know what I mean? Because we never said, hey, you touch this to answer. Yeah. So I'm, I'm now I'm genuinely curious to see if what I'm you do. Here, I'm hearing stuff behind us. Um, I, I have to say this. What? This is the third time. I keep seeing a red dot. <laughs> like at first it was by your legs, then it was back there, and then it was just right there. You're being watched. So they say the red lights, the little red flashes that you'll see, even though there's no light around, and you just see a like a red like spark almost. Yeah. Those are the, the essence of the spirit looking at you. And, and when it's red, it's dark. Yeah. yeah. What's up? I almost felt like I heard something running. Like, like coming in? I almost feel like the uh, tunnel below. So that connects down here, right? Yeah. Yep. So if it goes below and then comes up. The irony of like a red light meaning they're watching us and a red light for us means we're filming them. <laughs> yeah. It's like we're hunting them, they're hunting us. Yeah. We're on their YouTube channel. Oh, did you see that light over there? Oh yeah. That way. Hello? Hey, for real though, who's there? I saw it. Hey, there's so many. Wait. There was one right there too, bro. You saw that, huh? I saw that right there, yeah. It was, it was like right there, glowing, just white. from there to there. Did you see that? You see that? projection. Oh, projection. They're making you look this way when he's over here. Wait, what? I don't know what to do. I'm not ready to fight, dog. All right. We're safe. We have the ashes. 
You're good. Does does taser work on Skywalker? Yeah. Really? Okay, well, okay. it uses uh, electricity. Electricity, lightning from the thunder beings, is an actual substance that can reach into the spirit world. So, um, just like if you if we do get evidence when I'm singing the song, I'm gonna keep going, Colta. Don't make any uh, offensive moves. Just hold ground, okay? Even if something comes through, let it come all the way through. It's like a, it's an earth song. So the, especially when you're in a cave, you start blessing the, the earth around the rocks and you acknowledge the animals that live here. Even uh, in that last verse, you even mentioned the darkness and how there's not really light that comes in here unless it's the sun. So it's, it's all natural, um, pretty much just the darkness. And it's not like evil darkness, but just the, the shadows that hug you and hold you. It's a natural part of the world. Halfway through, I like almost started to cry. I'm super weird. My whole like right arm started shaking. My eyes started watering up. Wow. Yeah, I was just like sitting there. My arm was just like doing that, and my eyes like were literally like I was about to start crying. That's why I was really? wondering what. It, yeah, that was weird. What's interesting about that too is long ago, um, when the military would come, or even when there was wars that were happening, um, some of the indigenous people would go into caves like this to hide. And sometimes it didn't come out. Sometimes there's a lot of sadness that was around, and there's a lot of intense feelings of beings around. And what's interesting is I think what you're possibly tapping into is the Anasazi. So the Anasazi are an old ancient race that used to be around here, and they have a, a city that what we talked about before we came in here. This is their city. This is their home. So these cave systems were originally theirs. And so singing old songs like that, that acknowledge the creation, sometimes they haven't heard it in a long time and you might have empathically tuned into that. Yeah, like wow. I, I did, obviously wasn't gonna interrupt, but I like, thought I was about to start crying. Wow. That was weird. Wow. This is a one of a kind investigation. Definitely. An incredible experience. Yeah. I would be happy even if absolutely nothing happened. Like, it's just so cool, man. It Appreciate it, man. Genuinely, of thank you. Of course, definitely, guys. Yeah, this is. Uh, we're still on high alert. Like, I haven't seen anything like active skinwalkers here yet, but the spirits are still around. Those old spirits, so that's definitely still still here. So that's why I'll bring up the rear. Um, you guys can go ahead and get going ahead. It looked like no head, no feet, but like the body of a deer. Like, like right where my flashlight is. It was like, you know what I'm saying? Like it was like the body, but, but no, the head the no head, no arms, no legs. It was just like the body. It was just like, like behind Did you guys lock that. your vehicle? Uh, is the car locked? Find out right now. 
They're known to go in vehicles. Go in vehicles, steal things. And what we'll pay attention to before anyone goes in the vehicle is we're gonna scan the whole vehicle because there was dust that we came in. Uh -huh. Sometimes they'll write things on it. No. It was kind of in a misty color as well. Okay. You know? That could have just been a spirit too then. It could be either one. We should always be ready though. That's amazing. That's really cool. Like elephant. You like literally you feel like Marty with a red dot. Mm -hmm. That's exactly what it looks like. I thought one Bro, time. You saw a rabbit going through that. I man. thought one time. I give you props. As I think yeah. I thought when it was bottom, he was here and it was like bottom. By his leg. Yeah. Yeah. That was the one time I saw. I just didn't say anything because I was like, just, I don't know. That's sick. I'm glad you saw that. You weren't even expecting to see anything here tonight, right? At all. <laughs> Did you hear that, Evan? Yeah, I wasn't looking. It was like at... a... <laughs> Anyone hear that? No. Super loud. It was like a bird was right in my ear. Wait, I heard that. That wasn't you? The... Yeah. Yeah, I have no idea what that was. Wait, what? I thought that was you, man. No. Lights, lights off, lights off. Come on. Yay. Wait, now my eyes are unadjusted. Dude, we, we like ran into so many things. I like tripped five times. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> what the f***, Elton? You the right? I hate this so much. <laughs> This is why you said lights off. You set me up. <laughs> I, can, I thought I trusted you. You're I thought catching you trusted on. You're dude. catching on. Jesus Christ. <laughs> I'm like, ain't no way. Ain't no way. What? What the f I mean, those will be no, uh, like your oils left. That's no. a paw print. No, right here. Or, That's a paw print on your gas tank. But check out the difference right here. Look, look at see, the difference. See, these are your fingerprints right Those here. Are ours. There's the white right here. Look, look check this out. <gasps> what? Here's the thing. My truck's open. What? <gasps> the back window too. I, I left it open on accident. Oh no. But look at the handprint. I mean, that could be from getting out. Dude, that's a paw print. Yeah, that doesn't look like the rest of them. Then why would we have touched the gas tank? Exactly. Yeah, there might be something in there. Be careful. They can put poison on there. So. Wait, they can put poison in the car? Yeah. Wherever you touch, some places. They How's the truck? Poison. Good. Oh, it's harder to see on silver. If it was humid before, it's five. Oh. Move your light, brother. It looks just like that one over there. Don't be touching my shit. Hey. Yeah, human can't do that. Like I'm trying to think. Like, can anyone have just put like your? I guess if you did that, it could maybe, you know what I mean? But like, that's really complex for a human hand to do that. <laughs> yeah, look, I just tried oh, it. Oh yeah, that's not the same. No. I just tried it. That That's so perfect. And it ends like right there. It's almost like it goes, boom. Or you, see, it doesn't even make sense if you go this way. No, it has to be this way. Cause it has to be starting the fingertips. Look at up. how it looks like a paw. Yeah. You see how our fingers don't make these little smudges like this. Our fingers look like those over there. Not like these weird things. Yeah, your fingers almost clean the truck. That's good. I'm gonna be looking. Please do. I went shit jump out. Whoa. I, don't I just it. saw something duck down. Oh, what? something, something just ducked down behind the rock. No way. I swear to God on my life. That one? Swear to God, right there, something ducked down. Where? It was very, very small. Like it was like the size of like a rabbit. So it could have been an animal. I haven't seen a single animal out here. No, none. After every paranormal investigation, we always give offering back to the spirits. Thank them for the communication, for them interacting with us, and then just us coming back safely. Always be thankful for that. Yeah. that we're still alive. We didn't lose anyone. Just go ahead and just take a pinch and hold it. Hold it? Yeah, just hold it in your hand. So we're gonna go ahead and face where we came from. Uh, thank you for allowing us to come to your area. Thank you to the old spirits that are here, for allowing us to come on and being able to interact with you, to hear your stories. And we're gonna be, go ahead and go from here. I'm gonna give this tobacco as an offering. Share it amongst your friends, uh, whoever is here, all of the beings, you share it amongst yourselves. And in exchange for this offering, we draw a line in the sand. 
You are not to follow us home. You're not to follow or attach yourself to any of our physical, spiritual, mental beings. You're not to attach yourself to any of our objects. We're going to separate from here on. This is where you choose to stay and we're going to go on from here in a good way. Protect us on our travels, Creator Spirits, all the other beings around. Kiaho, thank you for an amazing night for protecting us and taking care of us. So we can just sprinkle it in front of you in an emotion. Yeah. And then whenever you turn clockwise, you always turn clockwise. Good. Good. All right. Oh. Thanks, man. Thank you. Yeah. We'll see you guys tomorrow. Yep. You're sick. That was, that was super tomorrow. cool. Yep. Thank, Thank you guys so much. Oh, this was super sick. Ice your back. We are currently six hours away from the nearest city. Uh, we don't even know, honestly, where we are. We came here tonight to the two medicine men to look for skinwalkers. Right now, they're going after this new blood right now. We gotta go stop them real quick. Well, they caught one. 